This video is a 5-minute introduction to editing your Journo portfolio site. In preview mode we can view what visitors to our site see. To enter edit mode, click the edit icon bottom left which appears when logged in. Let's talk through the main parts of the editor. The first tab allows you to see your site analytics. Items allows you to see any portfolio items you have added. The Pages tab allows you to see existing pages. Pages are what appear in your navigation and each have their own URL. The Design tab allows you to customize the global design of your portfolio, such as fonts and colors. Settings contains various options for managing your site, for example, you can edit your bio, portfolio title and social media links here. You can also edit your URL, control who can visit your site, and see subscribers, contact form messages, and your media library. Under integrations you can connect with third-party integrations like Google Search Console. Export allows you to export portfolio items as a PDF and directory gives you control over how your portfolio appears in our public directory. Finally the Accounts tab lets you invite someone else to edit your site with you. Account allows you to manage your account details and subscription. Now let's look at how to add a new section to your page. Click the Add Section button to choose one of our many pre-built designs. You can click Edit Section to customize how it displays. Easily change the color palette, the number of columns, or edit the spacing. You can change the order of sections with the arrows. Duplicate a whole section or copy it to a different page. And delete a section like this. Now let's add a new block. A block is a simple unit of content you can use to create your own page layouts. Click the plus icon above or below an existing block. Then choose the block type to add. Once added you can edit the block settings to configure it. Like sections you can reorder blocks. And duplicate or delete them. You can also drag them into another column or section. Now let's add a new page. Go to pages in the left sidebar and click add page. Enter your page name and click add. You can build the page yourself from sections or choose a pre-built page template. To edit the details of a page go to Pages and click on it to edit it. Here you can unpublish the page, or set it to not show in the navigation. You can make a page your home page or duplicate it. You can also set the social sharing image or SEO description here. At the bottom you can delete it. To change the order of pages drag and drop them into the order you want or make a page a subpage so that it appears in a drop-down. Finally, let's look at portfolio items. To add a new portfolio item you can either click Add under Items in the left sidebar, or click the plus on an existing portfolio item block. Enter a URL, or select a PDF, image, audio or video file to upload. Use the blog option to publish an article directly on your portfolio. Edit a portfolio item to change the title, description, date or image. You can also assign which blocks the item appears on. Use the description on open option to add more detail about your work. Add existing items to our article block by clicking Add and clicking on them. Or set the block to automatically add items. This is useful if you have a lot of items. Click Reorder on the block to change the order of the items. You can set a manual order or order them automatically by date. Click Edit block to customize the design of the block to suit your work. Use the gallery, image or slideshow option to display a photo gallery or other image-led work. 
That concludes our five-minute overview of the Journo Portfolio Editor. Check out our other videos and articles for more tips and advice.